bitch ass is up. I'm tired of your bitch ass. Gathering proof. Here's for us. I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure what to do. There's been so much crazy shit going on. I can't even explain. Yeah, it's all about Max Caulfield. I can't trust you or anybody. What's the point? Wait, Kate. I'm sorry. Please. You don't have to do this. Max, I'm in a nightmare and I can't wake up. Unless I put myself to sleep. Don't put yourself like that. Then everybody at Blackwell can post pics of my body. Don't downgrade your life to some fuck motherfuckers, No wonder they call it a web. There's so much more to life. Nothing can ever get out. Like my video. Don't. I wish I could go back in time and erase everything. No, don't just go yourself. Be strong. Kate, this is our chance to beat the bullies. That's the only way we can win against them. Can we really, Max? I don't believe in miracles anymore, either. Now I do. You're part of the reason why. If you come down with me, I can tell you more. You're such a good person, Max. Even if you're full of crap. But I'll come with you. You're my friend. Forever. Can we hug on it? Please. No. Nobody cares about me. Nobody. Mother, your sisters. Your sisters, I come on. I saw that cute photo of you with your sisters in your room this morning. I don't want her to jump, bro. Two more pick of a step, bro, and she's done. She just gone herself. She's only ten. She does have the best smile ever. Your family, every place of being that loves you, doesn't want you to be disguarded from this world. If she was here, you would know what to do. This isn't the end, Kate. There's no way God doesn't have big plans for you here. It's not just Thank God. You can so much. But God put me on this roof. There's a sin. I don't know what to say, yo. This shit crazy. Yo, yo. We'll be a time when, yo. When they suicide, I said, yo. Shit, I don't know what to say, yo. This shit crazy. There ain't no way. Because if I say one little clinch of a thing that rules out any say of compassion that she might have to herself, she's done. Like them two steps, big. She about to die. And them two steps is already one clinch woman. I got one chance in the book. I got a punchline. I got to be the most precise and say my for my feeling. My heart is racing. There ain't no case where I could possibly put her off on the roof. Cause one little step back and that's it, that's just looted from the world. There's so much other better linemen of this world. And I hope anybody that goes through a case of suicidal things don't take down no load on yourself. You can brighten better point for yourself. Push to be better. Make livelihood. And I'm always gonna be riding with you, no matter the case. Like, I don't know what to say. When justice is done, it brings joy to the righteous. What terror to the evildoers. I don't believe in justice, Max. I don't believe in anything anymore. Put some heart in yourself. No! no! Shit, dude. Fuck. That's terrible. Oh my god, dude. That's painful. I try so hard. I didn't know what to say, dude. If I thought I pulled suicide as a sin. I know this isn't is pleasant blood. for any of us. But we have to go over what happened before Miss Marsh. Before she did what she did. 
Officer Barry will be taking notes for the official police inquiry. I'm sure you'll give him your full cooperation. Such a tragedy. But there must be a reason for everything. We need to find out why Kate Marsh would be driven to such desperate action. As principal of Blackwell Academy, I take my duties seriously. I take the well-being of every student more seriously. What happened today should never happen in a hall of wisdom and knowledge. Mr. Madsen, as our head of security here, those roof doors should always be locked. That's just standard operating procedure. They were not. And that is indeed your responsibility. Mr. Jefferson, I know you can't be expected to know what your students are going through. But Kate has assisted you in class, so you should have known something was missed. Mr. Prescott, since you are responsible for the Vortex Club parties, and since Miss Marsh did attend your last party, you'll have to answer some more questions. Miss Caulfield, why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Did she tell you her plan? Or anything at all? Please, tell us everything. The pivot thing, nearly dosed her, cried, they even bullied her. Harsh point. Save her mouth All I know is that Kate was no, at a party and Nathan dosed God her. God damn, that put me she down. She got wasted though. and kissed some I boys on a viral video without a on. clue. I dosed her <laughs> without a clue. Have you seen the video? Whatever. Kate was loaded and You're a liar. The field. You told Kate you took her to the emergency room. I said I was going to take her to the ER. She sobered up eventually. Bullshit. Something happened to her and you know it. How about we talk about you waving a gun in the girl's hey, back? That's total slander. I could sue you and this school so fast. Why are you going to slander the whole school like soon? Careful, Mr. Prescott. Man, shut your ass up. I have been told dumb. of this alleged you gun like accident. Wrong, and I have to admit that Probably the video hair question chest, was sent to me by multiple up. sources. Including me. And since Mr. Prescott does appear prominently in the video and was responsible for the party, I have no choice but to suspend him until further notice. Whatever. See you in court. Excuse me. I think Max and Nathan need a break before we grill them further. A friend and fellow student is dead. And they don't need this forum right now. Yes, I'm kind of devastated right now. I'd like to be with my family. All right, Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. My head is killing me. But I think I can use my power again. It's the first time I use my power again to really run through the possibility for what can happen if I say the other alternatives I have. Mr. Madsen was bullying Kate. Oh, grow up. Excuse me, I was there. I saw you getting in her face. You have no idea what you saw. Kate Marsh was involved with a bad crowd. I was trying to find out who. Kate had a double life. I was super shocked when I found out. No, you were part of the crowd. And like I said, I personally saw David physically harass Kate Marsh. You lying little. Are you gonna take this junkie's word over your security officer? I know she smokes and deals marijuana. That has nothing to do with Kate. Max, falsely accusing other people seems to be a habit with you. I trust my security officer. I'll have to investigate to see if this accusation is true. Therefore, Max, I'm obliged to contact your parents and suspend you for a few days. Excuse me. I think Max and Nathan need a break before we grill them further. A friend and fellow... Please sign here to confirm what you. That was not the best observation. Let's just go with Nathan. I do want to test to see what happens when I say Jefferson made her cry. Because saying that is not the most borderline point of proof.
but you were harassing her a little bit and bullying her. And the I way saw you Mr. Jefferson just talking to Kate fake right before class. Observation. He didn't really put then no she point ran off through. crying. Mark, I do know that Miss Marsh has assisted you on class events. Kate, Miss Marsh has been very withdrawn lately. I assume this awful video was the cause. I hated seeing the students laugh at her. She told me Max was the only one who believed her, would take her calls and actually listen to her. She shouldn't have asked to be on video, macking with some dudes. You asked! She's a bitch of she didn't ask for any of this. No, on the contrary. Max was right to bring this up. Now, I've wanted to help, but I guess I was too late. Well, now this is problematic. The publicity is rising, and perhaps you shouldn't represent Blackwell at the Everyday Heroes contest in San Francisco. Are you serious? I am. We don't need any negative press about that event. And we need to involve the Academy in possible disciplinarian measures for you. I understand. There are bigger things at stake than me. The life of a young girl, for one. Maybe you should investigate other staff members. Max told me she knew things about Mr. Madsen. Let Max speak for herself. Everything we talked about here will be looked into. All right, Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm. No, I'm going with the Nathan one. He just seems sorry, kind of sincerely. I'm not saying that to put down what he's saying, but Nathan is the one who wanted to do it. That was just an experiment. Nathan seems the most realistic and most profound. We put that nigga in the slammer. Like, Nathan is the main reason. Take what you want about David bullying her. Take what you want about Jefferson accidentally making her cry. But this nigga Nathan is the menace. Get him. Please. You are the main reason for why she killed herself. Like, there ain't no fucking disc playing on nothing. No, I'm, I'm sure about my decision. I, I'm signing the statement. Fuck this nigga Nathan, bro. Dave, you should just know better as a grown ass man. Jefferson, well, I think we know less now than when we trying started. to do that. So we'll be assisting yeah. the police with further inquiries. I know this has been a stressful day. I wish I had the power to change it all for the better. So thank you for coming in. I just can't believe it. It's like it wasn't even real. Watching her drop like a weight. I really thought I could save her. Like Put her a in a different mindset, man. That's so Come on, sad. Max. Do not for a second blame yourself. Kate was on that roof for her reasons, not yours. My hand just reached out. Stop it. You were the only one with balls enough to run to the roof. You were the only one who cared. Yeah, I sure made a big fucking difference. Maybe if more people cared, better people than me. You're the best person around. Warren, I screwed up today. That makes no logical sense. Warren, I don't mean to sound weird, but there's something ominous going on at Blackwell. Today proves that. And I'm working on proof that Kate Marsh is connected to Rachel Amber. Somehow. Along with Nathan and Mr. Madsen. I'm not a big conspiracy guy, but I wouldn't doubt it. Nathan did scare me yesterday, and Madsen is a straight-up dickhead. Yeah, so, the fuck out of you. what do you think is really happening? A bunch what the of hell is this? And my work is in the back. The weather confirms this weird day. I feel that chill. Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I would know. I would. I believe you, Warren. I believe anything this week.
I don't know if we could save her. See my a probability. Ted Bundy tapes, man. There's a nigga out there, and we gotta find him. Out of time. Well, guys, this left me heart broke. I used to say, man, for other Pac Man and stuff, I was able to read, yeah, it's like Bugandos. I don't know if I'm saying his name, man, Bugandos. Maybe. I wish I'm able to obsess with read points and math for everything else. And they're popping off different. I can't run my heart into the ground, man. This shit was unfortunate, man. Rest peace to Kate, man. I ain't crying, but like, in my heart, man, that's a bro down thing. This is the first time on my channel where, you know, you get to see a little bit of the sad of mine, you know. Almost happy, almost all the time. It's just, I kind of saved her, man. And people in real life really go for that shit, man. And everybody deserves to form some happiness. And, when you run people's life into the ground, man, there ain't no certainment of hope for them. It's terrible. Like I just said, I'm happy almost, already for the time. Every day, same matter on my channel, I'm always happy trying to impeach some goodness. Ain't no place where I'm at, I always put to some pace of positivity for the... This is just bad, man. Like, getting this kid in Marsh. I don't know how to... Just peace to her character, man. Miss Kate. Deserve better, mom. Well, guys, I'm gonna see you guys in the next one. Peace out, mom, man. Love y'all. Couldn't save Kate. 4%, 56%. Yeah, I can see it.